From millennia-old spiritual practice to modern staple of self-care, the art of meditation has a long history. Whether you are seeking enlightenment or just need a break from the madness of the outside world, the act of sustained inward focus can be an amazing experience. But just because your mind is calmed doesn't mean that your brain is on break. In fact, the act of meditation has a measurable effect on the activity of your brain. If you're new to meditation, you might begin by trying to clear your mind and focus your attention, perhaps on your own breathing, the sensation of your skin, or maybe a single thought. As you do this, the brain's natural rhythms, called brain waves, begin to shift. Beta waves, the choppy rhythm associated with active thought, gives way to slower alpha waves, prevalent during relaxation. Experienced meditators can also produce stronger gamma waves during meditation, which are associated with deep concentration. Different regions of the brain begin their specialized work as well. The premotor cortex and the insular cortex fire up, increasing their activity as you quiet your mind. These regions are responsible for a host of activities. They regulate your attention and control awareness of your own body, thoughts, and emotions. And just like pumping iron at the gym, practicing meditation can make these regions stronger. The cerebral cortex of frequent meditators is actually thicker than that of non-meditators and has more folds. Meditation may also reduce your stress, improve your mood, and even ease the symptoms of anxiety and depression. So it's a miracle cure, right? Well, maybe not. A lot more research is needed to figure out exactly how much potential meditation has as a treatment. After all, we're still unsure if it is meditation that can treat anxiety disorders, or if people who have less anxiety are simply more likely to meditate. Scientists are scrutinizing these links to learn more about the connection between meditation and wellness. But ancient wisdom may have a head start of a few thousand years over modern brain science. There's not much downside to trying it out, though. Just sit back, breathe deep, and concentrate.